got a little bit of snow. This is late for us. On the road with my two buddies here. This nuisance right here. This is Damien. Me, Damien, everybody. We're gonna have to put our four low for this today. Holy smokes, hang on, brother. Oh, wow. We got a lot of snow. Wicked, wicked, wicked. Good dump of snow we did have. This is actually not going to be very easy to push today. Oh man, the joys of winter. Wicked snow, eh, man? Crazy. You can shovel the snow, I'll just get in the truck. It's a lot harder to plow with snow. Three dollars an hour. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. How's the, uh, how's the snow shovel going? <laughs> be used to that he's a heavy equipment operator so should be a joke to him of course common thing here is locks freeze up you put lock the icer and stuff on them and whatever else but gotta get some heat on there and you can breathe on it a bit but you only get one chance then if that doesn't work then it's really frozen tight hey you nuisance you guys have been asking where Willow is. She hasn't been in the last three videos. There she is, guys. Woohoo! It's that time. That time. Don't worry. She's going to get her used this winter. Every now and then, this invariably happens. Your truck gets stuck with the plow on the front. So when you try to push too much snow to one shot, your plow gets buried in behind, and that leads to some shovel and let her out. You're up, Damien. guys she's stuck stuck so I'm going to call in some reinforcements here Advantage to having a super wide. Let's get it. Woo! So stoked. Might as well take her for a short ride, buddy. Give her. Get some cobwebs at her. Lots of rides come on that one in winter, guys. Stay tuned. You like the snow? 
Well, pretty much got her cleaned up there now, guys, and uh, just wanted to do a quick short video of the day. Uh, you guys were asking where I was. I actually been on the road for pretty much five weeks. I was out doing some hunting and stuff, picked up my truck camper. I put out three videos where I was out there for those three weeks. When I came back into town, I went out of town for two weeks to do some for my regular job. And I'm just back. And uh, I'm glad I did come back when I did because there's a ton of snow. Winter has begun. And guys, I got some exciting stuff coming for uh, winter camping this year. That company Winter Will that uh, sent me that uh, incredible tent stove last year. They got a bunch more stuff coming to me and I can't wait to get it. So stay tuned for those videos. It's going to be exciting. All the excitement and snow clearing. Look what I just noticed. Holy cow, that could have been bad. You kidding me? See that the uh, tree blew over here. Two trees, as a matter of fact. I knew we had an incredible amount of wind when I left. And I'm so glad uh, I actually had, I had the uh, outdoor kitchen braced, attached with a ratchet strap to this tree thinking it would help keep the outdoor kitchen stable. I took it off just like two months ago. Just imagine if that had still been attached. Whoa, too close, too close. Also, I can see that the root of this one was really close to the, the corner stone of this part here. Again, if that root had been up and underneath that pole, it would have definitely lifted it up or tore it off. And again, devastation. Man, oh man, that's a near miss, that is. Too close for comfort. I'm gonna have to clean those trees up when I come down again next time. Are you, are you? Big butt! That's where I parked my truck camper for the winter now. My first winter ever owning a truck camper. I can't say I'm not a little bit nervous. I just wanna make sure that uh, keep the snow off at all winter, you know? That's a bit of a task here in Labrador when you have, believe it or not, we have an average of 14 feet here. Don't we, Will? Are you a good girl today? Anyway, Damien's out getting the cobwebs out of the machine there now. Just gonna clue up this last little bit of snow and we're gonna hit the road. Back here again tomorrow for four or five days. We're going ptarmigan hunting next. Oh yeah, he's having fun there now. Drive it like you stole it, buddy. So we're heading back. Stay tuned for some winter videos coming up. I know you guys like them. Lots of videos at the cabin, lots of videos at the outdoor kitchen, and lots of skidoo videos. Okay boys, we're hitting the road. Until next time, take care of each other. Get outside and enjoy everything outdoors. We will see you next time. Thanks for coming along, buddy. Yes, it's fun. <laughs> what do you got going on there, Willow? A little bit of snowball action. Yeah.